anyone want to go for a one dollar tat? You want to go for it? Okay, good. Good choice. I just graduated an online institution, so I'm excited to put my skills to use. Um, so I actually sketched this picture the other day of this really goofy looking ugly clown. Um, would you want me to tattoo this on you or do you have another idea? You wanted like a, a flower? Okay, let me just sketch one for you real fast. You can just let me know what you think. Where do you want this tattooed at? on your forehead, like in the center of your forehead. I don't know if that's a good idea, but whatever the customer wants, the customer gets. Do you think this is cute? Okay, good, I think so too. So I'm gonna start off just by cleansing the area so you could just relax, sit back, and don't worry, don't stress. Remember, I graduated an online course, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse the area, your forehead. So just hold still, just cleansing the area. Yeah, I put on hand sanitizer right before this, don't even worry about it. And I'm gonna go ahead and clip back your hair so that we don't get any of those hairs in the tattoo, which may or may not have happened before, but that's okay. It won't happen again. It's the it's the big part. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get my stencil wet before I put it on your face. It went in my eye. <laughs> on there. Okay, and just go ahead and look right at me. I'm gonna line this up right on your forehead, right where you wanted it. Just gonna go ahead and. Okay, perfect. Oh, perfect. It turned out amazing. Okay. Okay, so let's get my ink ready. I have it right here, and I have my ink container. I'm just gonna go ahead and do a little bit of like that, and then go ahead and dip my dip my tattoo pen into that ink. Okay, and I'm just gonna go ahead and hold the skin taut and go in. It should hurt a little bit, but nothing too crazy. Almost 
done to the finishing touches. Okay. Perfect. And I do use this new technique called lasering it in. I'm going to come in with this laser and this just sets the tattoo. It heals it faster so that you don't have to um, have that little plastic wrap thing on it. So. Okay, perfect. It looks so good. Do you mind if I take an after picture? Okay, perfect. I'm going to come in with my camera. Just go ahead and look right at me. It's going to be a bright flash. Okay, perfect. You are all good to go. Thank you for being my first tattoo client. Which lip gloss makes the best bumping sound? Let me know down below. Also, the full video is out now on my YouTube channel. Starting with this essence shine. Oh, you're here for your doctor exam? I'm a little busy here. Fine, sit down. Let's make this quick. I'm gonna listen to your heartbeat. Ready? 
Yeah, it's really fast. Are you like nervous to see me? Let me look in your mouth. Go, uh. I'm gonna have you put this on. Your breath is a little stinky. Reflex test. Yeah, you have reflexes. Yeah, putting on gloves for this because you smell. Let me know if this hurts. Let me know if you feel pressure here. Let me know if you feel pressure here. Let me know if you feel pressure here. Look in your eyes. You have two different size eyes. Read this line. Hold on. Read this line. Yeah, that's one. What color is this? It's red, not orange. What color is this? It's green, not blue. Let me look in your ears. Yeah, you got a lot of wax. You have to clean that out. And time for your treatment. You're done. Now, I'm going to check your stitches next. You have quite a few stitches, and I just want to examine um, to make sure that nothing is coming loose or out of place. Okay, great. You haven't noticed anything? Very good. And I have these gentle wooden pliers as well to help me. So you have horns at the top here of your head. Now these are pretty floppy. These pieces on the side here. Do these function as gills? Okay, okay. That looks good. Your ears. Pretty small, nothing wrong with that at all, actually. Eyes look very symmetrical. Your nose, that looks really good. Now on the side here, you have one, two, three, four heart scales. And on the other side, one, two, three, four, that's the same. Okay, great. Ridge, kind of going all the way down, way back. And then your tail. Perfect. Everything seems to be really on point. We can do your restitching. I don't think we have to do a ton of it. It's just to make it more even. Yes, I learned under Dr. Ina. The best of the yeah, ex yeah, exactly. Okay, great. We will go ahead and start here, but I'm gonna go ahead and get some gel for you first. So one moment. Just put a little bit here. That looks much better. It was really subtle, honestly, but that's good. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome, little bird, little bird, little bird, little bird. Today I'm gonna touch your face. Galera, olha só que ridículo. Ai, 
Não, foi só uma brincadeirinha. <risos> Ai, minha nossa, tá quase acabando a aula. Ah, mas não tem problema, você copia tudo pra mim, né? Ai, thank you. to start with the Mexican street corner.
do recommend getting two vaccines. One of them is for stuffing rot, and that is a preventative. And then the other one we can do, which is optional, is the stitch strengthener. You want both? No problem. I'm going to go ahead and put this on the arm where we're going to do it. And that will help numb as well. This one is for stuffing rot. Ready? Three, two, one. Just like that. And then the next one is the stitch strengthener. Ready? Three, two, one. All done. Do you want a band aid? Two band aids? No, you don't really need it, but I have some pretty fun ones. This really colorful. Yeah, okay. I have space, ice cream cones, tie dye. Thus, right here. Pardon my reach. Oh, it's extra sticky. And then the 